Pokemon escape rooms are a new way to challenge yourself when you play a Pokemon game, and you'll probably need a degenerate level of Pokemon knowledge to complete it. So recently, the YouTuber Smallant has put together a very difficult Pokemon escape room, and I decided that I'm gonna take it on and complete it within two hours. And if I don't, then I'll do to Bob Ross what I did to my boy Danny. Okay, let's start this escape room, dude. I am gonna click A, and the second I click A, the timer begins. We have three hours, let's go. Oh, all right. We have a Smeargle and a Togepi. Timid, own tempo. You have obviously Sketch, so we have to pick up a move somewhere. Miracle Counter, and Helping Hand. Are we doing double battles? What do you have? Shiny Togepi, Follow Me, Defense Curl, Swift, and Seismic Toss. Did we get anything in the PC by chance? There's a fisherman there. I feel like, you see, like, why are there NPCs here? Okay, we get the super rod. Do I have pokeballs? You're, yeah, we have the super rod, but do, do I have balls? No, I don't. Unless this guy gives me balls. Hello, good sir. I'll let you have a useful hidden machine for just $100. I don't have any money. So you're a poor piece of shit, then? I don't think we have a single Pokemon then. Okay, cool. What? Bold nature, cute charm, payday, assist, baton... 64 baton passes? Why? Payday. This thing has payday. Oh, I have an idea. I just had an idea. Okay, we're dealing with Sea King. Level 100? Holy, why? I don't think I'm gonna be able to do anything against, uh, can't escape. Okay, I think I just, I'm gonna wipe here. Yeah, I know. We wide it out. We have no money either. So I don't think I could take on those level 100 Sea King quite yet. Unless there's some weird gimmick I'm missing out here. There's an item right here. Oh my god. Is this the Reggie stuff? Oh, I need to translate this. So the first letter is D. The second letter is O. Don't. Don't hold on. Let me find it. Let me. I'm writing down what I'm. What I the information I have real quick. This is ridiculous. Is it telling me what I don't need? Don't need psychic. So I don't need Miracle. I think I just need to. It's telling me what I not. I don't want to use. Right. So just follow me and sketch. Is this a single battles? No, it's double battle. It has to be a double battle. These are double battle trainers. Clearly. Okay, what do you have? Lily and Rosa! You have six poke- Two level- Why is everything level 100 to start off with? Okay, hold on. What am I supposed to sketch? Am I sketching one of these two? How do I know? It's probably gonna be a move Mewtwo does. And then you do follow me so you could sketch whatever Mewtwo does. But what is Mewtwo gonna do? No, Absol. Absol's the dark Pokemon and dark super effective against Mewtwo. Am I like overthinking this? What do you use, Mewtwo? Psychic. How am I supposed to deal with Absol then? Wait, you just die. Wait, dude, you just simply die. So Smeargle's f right? Is this right? Yo, you're joking, right? Yeah, no, I, I f***ed up already. You're dead. All right, this is definitely not the answer. You have Razor Wind. Why would I try to sketch Razor Wind? Why? Why would I try to do that? What am I missing here? Oh! Oh! My eyes. I saw the little, like, shadow in the corner, dude. Oh my god, let me whip out the braille again. Oh, battling is not correct way. Always correct way. Wait, what? What is this last one? What is this first le letter? I'm, like, tripping out. It's not D. I, my mind keeps saying D. It's F. Okay. So let me think about not this battle. What's the other option that I could do if I'm not battling? There's me going fishing and maybe trying to get payday off. But that's not going to work because I'm never going to be able to outspeed a Sea King as Skitty. But you know what Skitty could do? But if I lose the battle, don't I lose money? Hold on, let me just try that out. Because maybe I could get the payday off if I use Follow Me on Togepi and then I could get money and get that HM. Maybe it's in before the HM is something goofy like Fly or something. I don't know. All right, so we know Absol's going to do Razor Wind. Am I trying to sketch Payday as well? I don't know. <laughs> like, what am I sketching here? Woo! We got coins, baby! Okay, um... What is the solution here? 
Yo, this is so much harder than VR missions, dude, that I did not too long ago. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Didn't I get through battles? I forgot what ROM house playing. In these older games, they won't force the double battle if you don't have two Pokemon, right? Is that the answer? But then what Pokemon do I bring? All right, let's just see how dumb... If this is actually the solution, I'm going to be a little annoyed with myself for not remembering this or thinking about that until 20 minutes in, dude. It took 20 minutes! Oh my god. Oh no. Okay. Uh, I need Rock Smash, so I need money for that. So bringing Skitty into here, is it a level 100 Pokemon? It's a Sableye. I can't hit Sableye with Payday, can I? Okay, this is... Mmm. Woo! Here's our next puzzle. Cool. It's not Skitty that I need to bring. I need to bring someone else. What? How am I going to get the money then to get Rock Smash? I have Psychic on Smeargle. Wait, I f***ed up. Maybe I really messed up there. I might want to reset this. I might want to reset real quick. This is going to count for my time, unfortunately. As he literally said, you are going to need like a degenerate amount of Pokemon knowledge to get through this. I can't hit this thing, can I? Foresight? Do I want Foresight? I'm trying to think. Why would I want Foresight? Scratch, Nightshade, Foresight. Let me see what other moves you have. Leer? I don't want Leer. No, f*** Leer. That's definitely not one of the uh, multiple choice options we're picking. So not Leer, not Scratch. Foresight would allow me to hit Sableye, but then how would I get Payday off with Smeargle if you only have one Sketch? What levels does uh, Smeargle learn uh, Sketch at? 1, 11, 21, 31. Oh, moves that all end in one. So one more level and I could get sketch again. So now I'm going to sketch the foresight and then try to level up somehow. I don't even know how I'm supposed to level up though. Okay. Okay, I could run away. What the hell? Oh, I didn't check my own PC. Please. Nope. Hello, please. Can you have an item in there? Smoke ball! Okay, we can run away from a battle. Um, a singular battle. We're not going to want to run away from Sableye. We're going to actually want to kill Sableye with Payday. An item to be held by a Pokemon. The holding Pokemon can flee from any wild Pokemon for sure. So, here's a goofy idea. Sea King has had no purpose this entire time. I give the smoke ball to Skitty. We faint Smeargle, or I have to level, it's, it's, there's one of two solutions here. You level up Smeargle, get Sketch again, and somehow Sketch Payday, and then Foresight Payday that way, till we get enough money to get Rock Smash to get out. Or I faint Smeargle, walk through the trainers with just, or faint Smeargle with Seeking. There we go, that's Seeking's use. We run away using the Smoke Ball with Skitty, walk through the trainers, and roll until we get Foresight off to Payday, and then try to kill with Payday, get that money, and then get out. I'm going to try the Seeking way because I want to include Seeking in this. <laughs> oh, sevens in the comments for Smeargle, who's sacrificing his life for us to escape this Pokemon room. Holy sh**, you're so dead. I'm confident we run away. Whoa, smoke ball animation. Get out of there. I, I, I don't know why I did not check my item storage way earlier, dude. You always got to check the arsenal before you go in. So... Assist until we get Foresight. Oh! Okay! It just went straight for Foresight. I'm cool. Payday. Holy sh**. That was a lot of damage. Alright. Three Paydays got off. Is this 100 coins? 285! We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, who can learn Rock Smash now? Um... But I think this is where you come in, Togepi. You can learn Rock Smash, apparently. At least I hope you can, or else this is where things get real strange, doesn't it? Defense Curl. Yeah, that's what definitely it was. Get, get Defense Curl out of here. Please tell me that this is it. Am I done? Oh, there's more here. Of course, there's more. I need Strength now. I don't want to just talk to... Okay, let me save state. I, I, well, these are going to be trainers for sure, dude. I'm looking for the Pokemon Smeargle. Want to trade for my 
Wobbuffet. Okay. What do you have? Item right behind her. Look at that. Whip out the Braille! Right? Is that is it talking about the Pokemon Muck? H-A-S? Muck has... What does Muck have? Muck has Dig. Oh, it's telling me who, what, what, what to expect. Muck has Dig. Muck has Dig, Mimic... Dig and Mimic. Is that it? Like, I'm actually using every ounce of brain power I have right now. This is insane. What does this next one say? I don't... I don't know, man. There's just so much going on. So there's so much Braille. I should be writing all this down. Muck has Dig and Mimic. So there's a Muck I'm going to be running into at some point. That is... Okay. So much Braille! The twins are vital, but... But why? What's the second letter there? Why? But I'll never what? The twins are vital, but you'll never beat... But you'll never beat them? The twins are vital, but you'll never beat them. Muck has Dig and Mimic. Only shiny if you have the... H... I... D... D... E... Only shiny if you have the hidden... Only shiny if I have the hidden what? Togepi is the only shiny Pokemon we have, right? So that's what it's refer referring to. So uh, Togepi's only use is for strength? Is that what that means? I don't need Togepi right now, at least. Maybe I will need Togepi for that double battle, though. Because the double battles are vital, but not... I don't need to beat them. I don't need to beat them, but it's, it's used for something. Just like that Seeking. Everything has a purpose, damn it! Okay. I'm getting hyped up for this now. I'm understanding. Slowly but surely, my brain is piecing together this puzzle, and it's driving me nuts. Small ant would not put something there without re- Oh, f*** me. Give me- Yeah, I am down for this. Goodbye, Smeargle. Wait, if I'm trading Smeargle away, then I don't want to use Sketch again. Right? Oh. Oh, wait a minute. That idea just got, like, wrapped up in a bag and tossed behind me, bro, right out the window. TM17. Okay, we got a TM. I'll check that out in a second. Sassy Nature, Shadow Tag, I cannot escape. Counter, Miracle, Safeguard, and Destiny Bond. Can I ignore these two moves? Because the, the hint earlier specifically said to ignore these moves, right? I think. Unless I'm misunderstanding it. Maybe that meant for only for Togepi, though. What was the TM? Protect! In terms of the th the... There's three battles total. I don't know which one of you two are battling. You mentioned Muck. So I'm assuming you have Muck? What do you... Okay, you don't have it. I'm looking for the Pokemon Togepi. Want to trade for my Stantler? Do I want to do that? Muck has a Moonstone. And I can't get it out. Can you help me? Do I need to beat a level 100 Muck for that to happen? How am I going to beat a level 100 Muck? Because everything I've been fighting so far is level 100, except for the Sableye. Um, okay, let's just go in there. Hello, ma'am! I'm here to help you out! Mm, yeah, I'm f***ed, man. Yeah, we counter these. Yeah, Muck dies. Do I get the Moonstone, though? Why do I even need a Moonstone? When I really think about it, why do I need the Moonstone? What's that for? Did you manage to get the Moonstone? You didn't give me one, did you? I didn't manage to get sh Missy? Skitty could learn Covet? Since when? 34? I have an idea. It's like, it, it was slowly processing in my head. I don't know if this is gonna make any sense, but I'm gonna try to translate this and be as coherent as possible with this, ready? So. We have to get Skitty to level 34 somehow. I am not going to be able to kill a Muck solo battle, or I'm not going to be able to kill Seeking si single battle. What I should do is use the double battle using the hint. It's vital, but I'm not going to beat them. So I could Destiny Bond. I don't know if it... I, I've never... I'm not familiar with double battles uh, too well, so I don't know if D Destiny Bond hits both of the Pokemon on the opposing side, but at least I could take one down. Follow me with Togepi. Maybe Togepi actually does have a use other than HMs. Follow me with Togepi so we could get the Destiny Bond off. And then Togepi dies. I switch into Skitty. Destiny Bond goes off, I think. Right? Either, either way, I could protect. They kill Wobbuffet, get the Destiny Bond off. Kill the Pokemon. 
This fucking works. What level does Skitty get to? Do we have to do this multiple times? I mean, this is going to be way faster no matter what than the Sableye idea. Goodbye, Absol. But then what move do I get rid of for Covet when that ha when we come to that? I don't know if that matters. Level 20? 24? Oh, you have a Lugia? What the hell? Yeah, okay. So I think I got to do this multiple times. I think that is the correct answer, though. Nice! Level 29 Skitty. Not bad. We get three levels earlier in Gen 3. I might have been looking at the more updated one. Okay. I think we're not using assist anymore, truth, truth be told. All right, let's just try grabbing the Moonstone from Muck. That was the next part, right? Oh. I don't have a save state back there, so we're kind of f Um, But you didn't have strength. You didn't have strength. I need strength to get into this house. The only mention of strength are the twins. We can't battle you if you don't have two Pokemon. You get your whirlwinds whipped up a little bit. We covet Mewtwo. And... Oh? Oh? HM4. That's strength, dude. So then what? Do I just get strength onto Togepi and I'm good now? Is that the end of this puzzle? Or is it Stantler? Is that the one you Stantler has? Oh, okay, okay. I had a heart attack for a second. I was like, where is it? Where is it? But it, it's you're holding it. Okay. <sighs> okay, it is Stantler. Oh, good to know. Good to know. Yeah, I'll do that. I just got rid of my smoke ball, you fucking idiot. Please let this be. Please, Stantler. You have to learn strength. You have to. You have to. You have to be able to learn strength, Stantler. I believe you can. You're, you're a pretty strong moose. All right, we have Stantler. Hey, thanks. You're so welcome. You are so welcome. Uh-huh. We could teach... Huh? What are, what do I have right now? What What is the answer then? Stantler has this. This is the rare candy. I'm not going to give it to Skitty because I've already gotten the move that I needed from Skitty. I don't have... What move would you have? Role play. Okay, so maybe that's something I need to do. I feel like I f***ed up big time, because now that I know that Stantler can't learn strength, that means the Moonstone is meant to evolve Skitty. If I'm not mistaken, Skitty evolves through Moonstone. Skitty evolution. It evolves. When exposed to a Moonstone, Muck is holding a Moonstone. Muck's abilities. Let me look up Muck's abilities. So you're not using Stench, Small Ant. You're using Sticky Hold. Where is it? There it is. Yep, there's the solution. Oh my god. That's literally the solution. So... I didn't even do the muck thing right at all, actually. I killed it, and I f***ed myself over. We get you to level 31, we get Covet. We get Strength, and then... Mm, it makes also, it makes complete sense now. Wow, that were... Without... I, in the readme, in Small Ants readme, he literally says, uh, everything in the game is vanilla besides the map itself. You can use the wiki and will need to use it most likely. Yeah! Yeah! I would have not ever, ever have gotten all this information if I did not have access to the internet. Protect. I really wish that this double killed though. Oh, Blava Fett died and it, it takes Absol and Mewtwo with them. So that'd be the juiciest amount of XP, but that's not the case. Beautiful. Yes. Okay, we hit 31. Let's get Snore out of here. We just need to hit you with Covet. Uh, follow me, Covet on Mewtwo, because you had it last time. Thank you for strength. All right, Skitty, you could die now. You could die a very wholesome death. Aww. Doing your job and dying. You actually need to die, Togepi, because we get through Rock Smash still. Trade, get Stantler back at full health, get the role play. Because then you'd kill, then I could just have to protect spam until I could get covet off. Die. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand this whole thing now. It's like a brain blast, you know? I just had a f***ing brain blast. Oh, give me that Stantler, thank you.
Item take. Because we level you up. You could learn role play. I'm going to just get rid of sand attack. I don't see any use for that. Let's battle then. Okay, you still have muck alive. Thank goodness. <laughs> I didn't confirm that when I reset. So, I'm just glad. But now the question is, does role play hit while you're in dig? It failed. I, I, I'm going to live with one HP. What am I supposed to do if you're just going to dig? Do I need to keep sending it until I get... Boy, that's ridiculous. Do I lead with Skitty instead? Can I assist the roleplay, maybe? Stomp. I could protect the dig. Maybe I need to get it to use its other move. How much PP is this dig gonna have? Like 16? Used roleplay, but it failed. Yeah, I don't understand what I'm doing here then. Now this is the one I'm getting stumped at. Am I being stupid and not considering move usage correctly? Hold on, let me look up roleplay. That should be the last one, right? That has to be the last one. Come on, come on, please. It used Mimic, there we go. You learned Protect. Oh! Roleplay! I copied the Sticky Hold? You and your Protect. You can't Protect forever, bitch. You, I think the, uh, the, the number of Protects you could theoretically land mathematically is 77 maximum, but there's no way you're gonna get all 77 of them off, right? You get two off in a row. Shut up. You're not going to get the third one off. You're not getting the third one off. You're not... F*** you. It's supposed to be getting astronomically harder. How is this possible? You're not going to get the fourth one off. You can get up to t 73 more, technically, but you're not getting this fourth one off. Oh my god. Okay, we're not going to get the fifth one off. Come on. Thank you. Damn, it got four off before I could get the moonstone. What? What? I had the smoke ball on. <gasps> oh no. Protect. All right, that's our last protect. We're expecting the mimics. Can I get a role play off with the first assist? That would be nice. You copy protect, which is fine. Again, you're not going to get that crazy RNG like you did last time. Role play. Stomp. Crit. Honestly, we'll just play it safe and roleplay with you instead of getting the assist. Just to be extra safe. You use protect. Cool, that's fine. We don't get the roleplay off this turn. Oh, we still do. And then I switch and then I can covet, right? Because you... Wait, do you just copy their ability? Oh... What? I just realized Covet's not going to work. You're joking. Because you're still, you don't take Sticky Hold from it, you copy it. You copy it, you still have Sticky Hold. There's more to the story that meets the eye, okay? Instead of just letting him mimic my Protect, that's not the correct move. I want to switch into my homie, okay? Stantler, who has role play. Mimic should fail, if I'm not mistaken, because there's no move to, like, Mimic from if I threw a new Pokemon out. And then I'll roleplay Heal Mimic, my roleplay, and then I'll switch to Skitty. You see what I'm saying? So, like, watch. He's going to Mimic. Because we know we PP stall Dig. So he Mimics, but it fails. And then I roleplay gonna fail again I role play use he uses mimic we definitely copied the sticky hold so here it out here it goes he still has sticky hold right now now he's gonna role play you take my cute charm ability yep that's what it was cute charm then I covet 
and now you don't have sticky hold. Oh my lord, that was annoying. That was so annoying. And I'm glad I caught that I had the moon or the uh, smoke ball earlier, or else that would have been real bad. And now we literally just die. <laughs> we die. Uh, so I have to get through the twins yet again. Who else could learn Rock Smash? That's not Togepi. Uh-oh. Wobbuffet, Stantler, maybe Delcaddy? If Delcaddy could learn Rock Smash as well, then we only need Delcaddy right now. All right, we got the, 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 the smiley cat. There we go. Delcaddy. Can you please learn Rock Smash? I am begging you to learn that. Yes! We only need Delcaddy. And you could learn Strength. That's amazing. I don't think we're going to need Assist anymore. Damn, what a giant adventure just to get two HMs. All this just to get two HMs? Head on over. Straight to the left. Use Strength. And then I'm sure there's, knowing knowing the uh, the difficulty of all this puzzle so far, there's probably one more part in this house and then we finish. Professor Oak, congratulations, you completed the escape. That's time. Wow. Bob Ross gets to see another day. Oh my god, this thing's existed in my room for years and you get to exist for another year, I guess. Well... I had a lot of fun playing Small Ants Pokemon Escape Room. I hope you enjoyed watching me do it. And if you did, leave a like, comment on the video, and subscribe. So I can maybe do this full time one day. Catch you guys in the next video.